Hey guys, welcome to your love reading for Aquarius. This is going to be for your January 2024. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. What do they want from you? So uh, we're going to take a look at the person that you're dealing with, thinking of, or someone that's coming back into your life. We're going to see what they want. And then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situation, switch the roles if you want. Keep in mind that these are general, general messages. Uh, so take what resonates and leave the rest behind. Uh, this could be with new love, current love, and ex. Uh, keep in mind that these are collective messages where the collective uh, Aquarius people not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post, when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, and my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Um, uh, support me on there too, okay? So, tell me about Aquarius. The person that Aquarius is dealing with, thinking of, or coming back into Aquarius's life. What does this person want from Aquarius? What does this person want from Aquarius? For January 2024, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Aquarius. And we have the Six of Wands. We have the Ten of Pentacles. This person knows where victory and success lies. They know that it lies with you. Yeah, they know that it lies with you. It could be an indication that if you guys are together right now, you know, things are just going really well. Yeah, things are just going really well between you guys. The Death card here and the Nine of Swords. It seems like you guys have been through something here or that you guys have overcame some sort of stress and anxiety here, you know? But I feel like, you know, with the Strength card, the Ten of Pentacles and the Six of Wands, I do feel like this is making your relationship even stronger than it was before here. It seems like this relationship is definitely going through some sort of evolution here, okay? It seems like there has been some sort of obstacles that you guys have been going through and I feel like those obstacles are being overcome here, okay? The Seven of Pentacles here and the Five of Wands here. You know, I, I, I get the feeling that, you know, there's an energy of like basically issues coming up and neither of you guys giving up, you know, you guys are just, you know, investing in your time and your energy, trying to fight, trying to overcome and trying to make the connection work here. Okay. Tell me about the Six of Wands here. Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Ten of Pentacles, Two of Cups. Yeah. Seems like an energy of like you guys are even stronger than you guys were ever before, like the bond that you guys have. Okay, the death card here and the two of wands, the nine of swords. Because I feel like at some point the connection hit, really hit a crossroads here. You know, it's kind of like an energy of like, do we continue this or do we not? Because things are changing. You know, the dynamics have shifted here. You guys and I have been together for a long time, but I do get the sense that you guys are definitely salvaging this. Okay, because someone here is definitely seeing this connection as their wish fulfillment here and they feel like this person doesn't want to lose it. Okay, so I feel like they made a decision to stay or that both of you guys kind of mutually made a decision to stay and work things out here, you know. So, you know, I do feel like things are working out. I do feel like you guys are definitely forming, forming a, 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 you know, a, a stronger bond than you guys ha have before or that, it, you know, it's gone through like a kind of like it's gone through some growth and evolution here okay what else do we have for for aquarius what else does aquarius need to know look out for work on for january 2024 when it comes to this love situation for aquarius for aquarius for aquarius sun moon rising venus signs for aquarius okay so we have the ace of pentacles here and the knight of pentacles here yeah, this person definitely has long term on their mind here. This person's definitely like thinking long term, thinking prosperity and wealth here with you. We have the Five of Cups here and the Magician. If this person, you know, took a step back, neglected this connection here, this person definitely does regret doing that. So I feel like this person's definitely like reeling it in. 
You know, I feel like they're not going to let their emotions get their best, uh, get the best of them. Uh, you know, I feel like, you know, obviously they're de definitely going to process their emotions here, but I feel like, you know, they're not going to let their emotions get in the way where they're, they're like walking away or running away from this. Three of Wands here and the Ace of Wands. Yeah, I do see you guys working this out. I do see you guys moving forward here, you know, pr planning for the future, moving forward, uh, perhaps even moving in together if you guys haven't moved in together here. You know, I do feel like the bond that you guys have is a lot stronger than it was before. Yeah, it seems like yeah, you guys are definitely overcoming obstacles, overcoming hurdles here. You know, I do feel like with the lovers here and the world card, yeah, I do feel like this connection can go very, 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 very far. If you guys, if you guys kind of like stay on uh, track and focus here and, and be, you know, a, be a team player, you, you know. So the three of pentacles here and the lovers, a Gemini energy and the world card here. Tell me the five of cups. So definitely a new beginning is happening here. Whatever you guys have been th going through, that chapter has closed, okay? And I feel like you guys are definitely starting a new chapter in your love story here, basically, okay? Five of cups here in the Hierophant, Taurus energy here, the Magician here, and the Six of Pentacles, okay? Yeah, whoever this is, I mean, this person's definitely willing to be, you know, I feel like this person's loyal, they realize their, their loyalty lies with you. They're willing to do what it takes to they're willing to do what it takes to make sure that this relationship works out here. And I do feel like this person's definitely pouring in a lot of energy here into this connection here, okay? Three of Cups here and the Ace of Cups. So I feel like this person loves you very, very, very much. I feel like this person really cares about you here. And I just feel like this person really wants things to work out here between you guys. Yeah, this person really wants things to work out between you guys here. I feel like moving forward, things are going to go really, really, really well. Okay, uh, I, I do feel like this person is definitely going to really put in the effort here um, and, and, and make this work. Like I said, if this person was neglecting you, rejecting you, or pushing this away, that's no longer going to happen anymore. I just feel like this person is definitely doing the right thing here to try and salvage what they can. Obviously, that's the best thing to do. You know, if it doesn't work out, obviously you guys separate, but I, I feel like it's it's really important to try and do what you can uh, until it doesn't work. And yeah, you just call it quits. But whoever this is, I feel like this person's not giving up. And because of this, you guys are definitely, you know, a lot stronger than you guys were before, okay? So Aquarius, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.